Arrived at Gotham U. What do we know so far about this professor? Kirk Langstrom. The half-finished file was big on Batman's radar. And that usually means something bad. Then I'll pick up where Batman left off. ID on this faculty dude, Kirk Langstrom. Right. I'll call it in on the way to the morgue. Langstrom's dead. Do we know where his office is? Seriously? Crap. Well, our notes had his office on the third floor of Molten Hall. Got it. Third floor balconies open. Don't mind if I do. Here's his office. Hmm. Hardly any police work here. Langstrom must have been killed somewhere else. Those marks look fresh. You find anything, Batgirl? So far, nothing here. Our professor is very dead. I'll let you know when I find the crime scene. Good. Well, not good exactly, but at least a lead. The real challenge will be getting out of here without the cops finding me. Good luck. This must be where Langstrom died. The cops cleared out of here way too fast. Langstrom must have been working when he was attacked. Significant blood loss here. Evidence of a struggle, then the attacker pinned them to the wall. They were merciless. Langstrom was dying, but he tried to get to that cabinet instead of the door. What was so important? A hidden door. What secrets were you keeping, Dr. Langstrom? A thermostat would be a clever place to hide a keypad. A microwave. I hope Langstrom wasn't combining burritos with genetic specimens. Langstrom might have programmed his tablet to open the door. Langstrom made sure to remember those dates. I should too. A movie poster in a science lab. Maybe the release date is important. A phone number, but that's not a Gotham area code. Could be useful. Perfect. Time to see what Langstrom was so desperate to hide.
Langstrom, what on earth were you up to? Batman's dead professor had some serious skeletons in his closet. Langstrom's workstation. I should take a closer look. Well, hello there. A hard drive. I need to get this back to Belfry. Then I can figure out your secrets, Langstrom. Hey, on my way back. The cops overlooked a ton of evidence. Weird marks on the walls, and apparently Langstrom had a secret lab. Hopefully this hard drive I found will have more answers. Great! Can't wait to get my hands on it. Great. Gotham needs to see that someone still cares. I'll take care of this. I can't focus on torch in this place with all that racket! Turn off the damn fire alarm up there! I need to handle these guys before this gets any worse. Probably stay out of sight here. Are the fumes getting to you, buddy? What are they even doing here? 
Bring the whole building down. forward to kicking back and decrypting this hard drive. Be there soon.
Good job finding that drive in Langstrom's lab. Do we have any idea... Once we can get at the data, we can figure out what our next move is. I'm going out. I'm not gonna sit and wait for... whatever this shit is. We're waiting for intel, Jason. Once we have it, then we'll go. <sighs> move. I'm gonna solve this case my way. He wanted us to work this together. Whatever. That's making this harder than it has to be, kid. I guess, since we're waiting anyway, we might as well take another look at what Bruce had on Langstrom. Crap. That must have been the secondary breaker. The primary went out months ago. I thought the backup would hold. I got it. No need. I've put in a small fix that should hold for a while. Wasn't sure you were coming, Alfred. I'll always be here when you need me, Master Richard. When any of you need me. I'm glad you're here. As am I, Master Tim. This place does need work. Damn it! We've got activity all over the city. Sweet. Looks like my plan wins. Hold up. We still need the intel. And Alfred can't exactly set this place up alone. Indeed, Miss Gordon. I have a list of supplies we'll need. I could do it on my own, but... It would be faster if I had help. You can count on us, Alfred. We'll divvy it up. Let's finish what Bruce started. <laughs> 